Let's go swimming. Let's go swimming. Okay. Judy says, question, dating man for about six weeks, and he definitely copied and pasted me in his future. Is this too soon or a good sign? <laughs> I love this. Copy and paste me. For those who are not familiar with the work of, where is she? Alison Armstrong. Alison Armstrong. She's a very sweet friend of mine. She wrote the book called The Queen's Code. One of the things she talks about is what she calls what men do is cut and paste a woman into their life. Now, I have a different terminology. I call it futurizing or try it on for size. And I can't tell you when a man is excited, when we like somebody and we're excited, we are amped up on lust and limerence. And for those of you, everybody knows what lust is. That's where I want to fuck your brains out. And limerence is, um, limerence is uh, extreme infatuation. When I feel extreme infatuation, I'm like, I'm, as a matter of fact, uh, you know, if I have a wedding to go to, I'm like thinking, how can I get her on the guest list? If I've got a trip plan, I figure, how can I get her to go with me on that trip? If I've got an event to go to, I'm like, oh, how do I get that person to go with me? And I start describing it. And this happens very early on. This is because men, when we like someone and when we're enthusiastic, we want to try it on for size to see if this person can fit into our life. That's a great sign when a guy does that. Now, for some of you, that might feel like he's coming on too strong. I'm going to repeat that. That might seem like he's coming on too strong. And yet some of the nicest, high value, high quality men do this. So is it a red flag that he might do it? And I know that wasn't the question. Red flags merely mean ask more questions. Just recognize this, ladies. When a guy is excited, that's a good thing. If he's more focused on the sex, that's not a good thing, okay? But when he's excited, that's a good thing. That doesn't mean you two are right for each other. It doesn't mean that you're the right relationship for one another, but that's certainly a good start. Don't we want to be excited? Don't we want to get enthusiastic? Don't we want, by the way, women used to do this all the time. They would be going, Catherine Asley, you know, Sharon Asley, Tammy Asley, trying out my last name on for size. Although my last name's a pain in the ass to say. But um, so it's very common to feel and want those things. So um, cut and pasting, I call it trying it on for size or futurizing. It's a very common thing men do. Um, it's not, I just consider that a yellow flag, not a not a red flag, not a you know, not a green flag. It's just a yellow flag. It just means when I say yellow, it means he likes you. But be a little careful because we can like you and then not like you later, okay? And this happens too because not everybody is compatible with one another. Not everybody shares the same values, uh, has blendable lifestyles or emotional maturity. All right, great question. Thank you so much for that one. I really appreciate it.